everyone. A few weeks ago, my wonderful boyfriend made me this cedar raised planter. It's about six feet long, two feet wide, and around 18 inches deep. We recently moved it up to the upper patio that sits above our garage. I'm so eager to start planting out vegetables that I convinced Brendan to help me put up some hoops and greenhouse plastic over it, creating kind of a low tunnel. So the first thing I did was line some landscaping fabric over the bottom and up along the long sides. I nailed them down with some roofing nails, I believe, or whatever nails it was that Brendan gave to me. Um, there are some pretty decent sized gaps between the boards at the bottom, which will be great for drainage, but it was a little bit too big and would have let too much soil fall through.
of Ponyx oil. Off camera, I also added a bunch of last year's used up potting mix and dead roots from a bunch of containers we had laying around. In hindsight, I should have bulked up the bottom third of this planter more, probably with some scrap wood or twigs that we have in the compost. We seriously have so much from pruned raspberry canes and tree branches. It's definitely something I'll keep in mind next time I need to fill up a raised bed. We then took a piece of 6 mil greenhouse plastic. I think the whole thing was 8 by 24 feet and we lined it up over the top. We cut off the excess, which was about half of that whole piece, and then used some snap clamps that I bought off of Amazon to keep it in place. So Brendan put in some 2x4s like horizontally in between those outside posts just to keep more of the heat inside. I think also what I'm thinking is we might cut the PVC pipe and attach like a wiggle wire channel across the whole thing just to keep it taut. In the next video I'll show you how and what I planted in here. Thanks for watching. Bye.